Alright, welcome back. We just had our first raider attack. Um, we are going to start building stables. And, uh, yeah, we're starting to advance through the age a little bit here. We're getting there. So, the way that I like to build my stables is I will build them in a line. <laughs> As you can tell, I like that. Um, let's try to make it flush with this, just in case we need to put anything through the middle there. And let's give it just a little bit of space off of the the food dryers to give a little bit of a, a walkway for our people. So let's just build two. And then the next two are going to go here and here. And then when we finally are able to place a well, the well will go right about here. And of course I built those just as we were going to start the planting season. <laughs> okay. We'll ignore that. We want them to focus on the planting. That's our first boar. Awesome. Let's do our best to try to rush four more knowledge points. We want to get up to sheep as soon as we're able to. And there we go. There's some more people. All right. We are one point away. Okay, that went a lot faster than I thought it would. Uh, so let's prioritize just one of these. The, the one that's going to be easier to finish. Then we'll have our knowledge point, and we'll be able to grab sheep, and hopefully there will be Mouflon around, and we can go and capture them. Oh, there's that one lone one. That's so sad. Don't see any in our immediate area yet. Where are you guys? There are some mouflons. No, sorry, those are ibex. Just kidding. But look at these. Got some mammoths. Let's just uh, toss on the old hunt button on one of them. See what happens. See how many people we send. one of these. We'll eat Rhino. Let's grab that. They say they're dangerous, but they're really not that bad. You are a lone Mouflon, right? Adult meal. It's a couple of Mouflon. Let's get both of these. So I want, I want to kill all the Mouflon in our area to hopefully force a respawn. I don't know how frequently those will respawn. got that. This is our materials one, so let's limit that. We got a lot of knowledge points on the board just waiting to be picked up here. I don't think all of our totems have been built yet. Nope. None of them? Why have none of them been built? Waiting for bones. Wow, they need a lot of bones. Now when we do see that mammoth attack flag, we're going to want to go and maybe micromanage that a little bit. Hopefully it won't be too bad. Let's see where we can get some knowledge points. I don't even know how to pronounce that, but if we can find one. We do have a willy rhino on the queue to be hunted. We've already hunted five mammoths. Cool. Um, we could find more deer. That'd be pretty easy. 
We'll get the cave lion and the wolf just by the attacks. We'll get the hyena by the attacks. Wow, we've hunted a lot of mouflons. We could hunt some more ibex. Then muskox. I think that means that they're already extinct, though, doesn't it? Maybe not. Oh, uh, we could... Five more huts. Another storage hut. I know. Oh no, you guys are in the water when you attacked? Are you idiots? Oh my god. This guy's gonna die. Oh my god. You dummy. You dummy. What are you doing? With just two people? Are you kidding? Yeah, that's why you gotta micromanage some of this stuff sometimes. That sucks. Now it says Holy Rhino escaped. No. No. You are gonna go and kill him. You are gonna go murder his, his face. If you're able to. <laughs> Going to raw meat. Going to burial mound. Where's the raw meat? I really wish you would just get revenge for our people. You have a spear. Okay, well, oh, there we go. We may be suffering the same fate here. We'll see. It looks like this mammoth is separated, though. There's two there. Hopefully we brought some dogs with this. Yeah, we lost one. Yeah, we might lose two. Because you're attacking with knives, you dummies. Yeah, three people died. That sucks, but that's okay. Not a big deal. Bro, you cannot just walk here. Stables, great. <laughs> Alright, well, before we click that, let's just do another check. See if any mouflons popped up, because I'd really like to get those sheep in the stables as soon as I possibly can. Donkeys, no. Ibex, no. Is there an Ibex? Don't see any mouflon. Oh, that sucks. I don't even see any adult mouflon. They're just gone. They vanished. What are you? Your ibex. Yeah. It'd be cool if you could tame mammoths, but boy can dream. I don't see any mouflon, so I think it's probably best. Yeah, we're hunting all the cybics. Uh, probably best to research something else. We do have a lot of knowledge points that are coming up pretty soon here. So let's research something else. Weaving could be an option. Um, fortifications. We did have a raider attack, so that might be a good option. Um, yeah, why not? We'll do that. Build a couple of gates. Build some walls. Now, as you can probably imagine, I like to have pretty clean lines for my walls. with the intention of eventually putting a bridge here. Let's place this in a gate. Okay. Go 
go there. Does that mean this needs to move? Probably not. I think we're okay. We'll be able to make it look good. That's where it gets a little tedious. It's not going to connect, is it? So cancel that. Yeah, you know, I should just drag it from the actual. Is it? From here. Really? Really, game? So there's our first stretcher wall. We'll probably take it this direction. I don't know how far this way we were going to want to go because it looks like we got some steep cliffs here. Do something like that see where we can get a wall down. There. Sure, why not? It should connect there. I'll keep one here just for this work area here and we will eventually put another bridge or two across this here. This is probably going to need to move. Definitely these trees need to move. That stone. I told you I need to clear that one. <laughs> okay. Young tree. I wish I could clear a young tree, too. That would be nice. does feel like we're starting to run out of food a little bit, but we've got our fields coming up pretty soon. Okay, I thought those were move funds. I was about to rage for a second. Average. We can maybe grab well digging. Be nice. 280 points. We'd have to get rid of some stuff. Now we are going to be using our logs. So we don't want to get rid of those. Uh, I don't know that we've got the resources to get rid of the to be able to. We could get rid of all of our flint spears. That's a terrible idea, though. Um, we do have 19 flints. So we could build them back pretty fast. Get rid of 10. We are just about to use our sickles. Um, we could probably trade a few bows. I don't want to get rid of too many though. And this straw actually is going to go bad soon. So let's get rid of some of that. Not all of it. Uh, we still need to make up some points, so... Definitely don't need that many flint picks. We can go down to 5. Now we just need 20 points. I think that's... Is that worth it? Yeah. Let's just do it. Okay. Slot that in there. doesn't hurt to have one at either end of the uh, 
housing row. And I don't know. Oh, <laughs> so we would create an isolated pocket. Okay. Well, that means I put that too close. Definitely don't want that. We want people to be able to walk through. That's fine. Workload's too high. Is it though? It's really not that big of a deal. It's food harvesting, hunting. Yeah, we're fine. It's gonna come down in a second. Great if we could get some new immigrants to our town. I think what might be holding us up is that our our storage hub for materials is down. That could be causing issues. So they're chasing ibex that are never going to be killed. I think we do end up putting that up a bit. I don't think we're going to be using the stone anytime soon, but... I just want to clear the area. What's our limit set at for these? Doesn't hurt to go up. Use more of that too. Yeah, I think losing those few people to the mammoth and the woolly rhino really kind of hurt us. over here? Are, we, are they gone? They're way over here. That's just, it's too far. I can't justify that. No, no mouflons. Is there anything in here that's mouflon? Doesn't look like it. Here's some. Okay. Well, we'll just have to. We'll just have to remember that they're over there. Hopefully, we can get our uh, seven points <laughs> pretty quickly here. our hut going up. Storage hut. Let's get this one upgraded next. I 
Okay. If we do our one more upgrade, do this upgrade, then we'll get a knowledge point. If we finish upgrading these, we'll get a knowledge point, but we really don't need to do that quite yet. He has these totems. These totems up. Just one more totem. There it goes. Awesome. That'll be a point. So we just got all these dry skin or raw skins. Let's toss that down. Mufon's still around here. Some pigs. Where'd they go? They're right here. Okay. They're still there. Workload's too high. It's not, though. <laughs> it's okay. It's only 200%. Just have babies. Have immigration. Prestige is pretty good. There's not really anything we can build to boost our prestige. Nice to get one of these wells up. Get a point. Get a knowledge point for building a well. We will need that well there for the animals. So might as well just grab it, right? Here it goes. Got a good amount of food. Yeah, once we finish these wells, I think you get a point at three wells. Let's get rid of this. We don't need that there anymore. Why are they making six bread? We don't need that. Oh, you don't get a point at three wells? You probably need five then. Let's just hunt these orcs. Just right there, I mean. There we go. Okay. Let's grab sheep. And there's our mouflons. I don't want to hunt the adults until after we get our sheep. And we will toss our animal panel right there. Let's look around to see if there are any more mouflon. Oh, but they got no babies. Where's your babies? You're getting hunted because you don't have any babies. I know we got to kill a couple of these for points. And 
Let's cancel that. We don't really care about that. Donkeys. <laughs> I think it's so weird that you can, like, hunt donkeys. It's just very strange. Okay. Alright, so... I believe... Yeah, I set that to zero. So we want to put that to 20. Hopefully we'll get those baby mouflons. Turn them into sheep. Start boosting our population here. Could really use it. Looks like we are going to have more tents to upgrade real soon. Looks like all of these. But I don't. Eh. Yeah, we're good. Need to do mud collection. Hmm. It's looking pretty good. Looking pretty good. And these trees got cleared out. I, don't, I wonder if I could get that up that might be able to. Let's, let's cancel these. Okay. Trader, I was just going to go check on our mouflon, but... He's trading goats. Don't care. Don't want goats. They are not useful to me. But I do have some stuff that I could get rid of. Um. Let's check on our mouflon. Oh no, are they gone? Oh no. Oh no, where are they? Ah, <laughs> scared me. Going after Mouflon. Okay, let's get our first Mouflon, and then I think we can call it an episode here. My dog is uh, dinging the bell, saying that she's got to go outside. Go get him. Go get him, buddy. And this one must be going after the other one. They get at in the rocks. Okay, then we are going to hunt you. We're going to hunt you. And there was. Was there a third one? I thought there was a third adult. Is it just two? Alright, we have our first sheep. Excellent. And our other one is being tamed right here. Beautiful. Okay. We are in a real good spot here, guys. Let's look and see. We have two female sheep. They are young. So, we are going to be on the lookout in next episode for a couple of young male mouflon. And maybe even some more young females. Excuse me. All right, well, thank you for joining me. I hope you enjoyed the episode. Uh, we made a little progress this episode. Not not a terribly high amount, but we did pretty good. Um, yeah, next things we're going to want to focus on is getting our sheep population up, tacking up to flax, and weaving. Those are going to be our main focuses here. All right, well, thank you for uh, tuning in, checking it out. I'm Crywolf. Uh, if you want to give me a like or share the video with anybody else that you know that plays Dawn of Man, that'd be pretty cool. I just want to want to help build this community's base and, and get interest going in the game because I really enjoy this game. 
All right. Well, thank you. Have a good day.